What the hell is this? We got to get in there. We will, but the fence is a problem. Let's split up and see if there's a weakness in the fence. We'll look at that. Hey, guys. We might have a way in. Oh really? Yeah, there's a car blocking the back way, but we should be able to get around it. Wait a minute, this isn't just a regular car, this is a Humvee. What is this doing here and why? I don't know, but it looks like it was trying to flee given its absolute piss poor turn into the fence. I'm scared to open the door. Oh come on, the vehicle's probably empty. We can slide inside it. Holy shit, what is that? We have to get out of here. Now. Agreed. Here's some of the financial paperwork you asked for boss. Thank you. I should see if we've finally gotten this business back from the dumpster this time. Oh my god, we've done it. We actually managed to get a positive cash flow income for the first time in a while. This feels unreal. We're fixing the reputation of the company Evan had destroyed years ago. Hello, who is this? Hey Joseph, how are you? I'm good, Dad. What's the problem? Well, uh, today I got a call from the original Billy's Burgeria restaurant that's in Wisconsin. Okay, what happened? That place shut down in the 80s. Well, uh, yesterday. Some people went into the property to make a video documenting its history and the mystery behind it when they came upon a barbed wire fence. Huh, so someone decided to fence the property? Odd, I don't remember that happening since its closure I thought it was just left to rot. Yeah, and there's something else I've just got word that a military vehicle was found crashed into the fence and it had a corpse in it. Wait, wait, wait a minute, an army vehicle was there, why? For what purpose? I don't know. Look, we might be overreacting but we are still gonna check it out, and I know the reputation has slowly improved and all, but just be aware. Yeah, okay, thanks for telling me about this. Oh boy, I need to inform Brianna about this. Meanwhile? What the hell is this? Hey, aren't you the CEO of this business? Um, yes I am. What's the problem? Do you mind explaining what this pathetic excuse of entertainment is at this stage? Um, 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 I, uh, don't have any words and uh, need to leave by. How is that all this time later and we still haven't gone one year without having missing animatronics? The guy who was stealing them is dead, why is it still happening? Hello, who is this? Brianna, we need to meet up at the headquarters now, it's urgent. Um, okay, what's going on, Joes? Something happened at the original Billy's Burgeria according to my dad. What, what do you mean? What happened? I haven't seen what exactly happened which is why I want you to come now. Alright, I'll be over. Okay, what the hell is going on Joes? Well, that's what we are trying to figure out. I know the brand's reputation is slowly getting better and everything but, this might be more serious than what Evan did. I hope it's not too bad. We still need to fix that problem. Well that's exactly what we're going going to do. What, we're going to investigate what happened over there? Yes, I want to see what is going on, we should try to figure it out. Look, we don't know what's happened and we're gonna see if we can fix it. I just hope it isn't what I think it is. Hey. Call and make sure we have a way of getting to Wisconsin. We want to go over there as soon as possible. Let's just hope we find what happened, and then we can do some PR work. The last thing we need is the company to be overshadowed by yet another disaster. I don't think that we have to worry too much. We just have to make sure we are safe and we can handle what we see when we arrive. The building is about 20 miles away. I already got a rental car outside the airport.
Man, what happened to this place? Things are getting really strange. When the heck did this happen? Who the hell did this? Well, the vehicle has military markings on it. So, the military had something to do with this. This is a mess, and how the hell could something like this even happen without anyone noticing? Hey, who are you two? What are you doing here? I'm Joseph, and this is Brianna. We own Billy's Burgeria and we're here to investigate the property. And who gives you that authority? Well, we own the property, and the land is private. Also, we have the right to see if there is a connection between what happened here and the events that happened here a decade ago. And me. Oh, uh, hello sir. I'm Alan, I'm Joseph's father, and I'm an FBI agent. So I have the right to be here. Uh, well, um, okay, but we're still investigating the scene. Look, we understand that, and we are going to work with you. But we do have the right to investigate the property, as the owner of the land. And the sooner we can get started, the sooner we can get the answers we need. Well, the most obvious question here is how in the world this fence got set up. This building was shut down in the 80s, so no one should have been allowed to do this. Well, I have some information here on the property and the only people that were supposed to have access were the owners of Billy's Bergeria and the city. After its closure in 1985, there were no official reports of anything going on the property, so whatever this is, it must have been done illegally. So, I guess we could say the military did this. Okay, so why would the military be here? That's the question. Look. Let's see if there's a way inside, and we'll figure it out from there. There's an opening here where we can squeeze past the Humvee and fence and get in. Are you sure? Yes. Well, I guess that's a way in. Wait, there's more of these Humvees? Why though, and the front door is boarded up. Either whoever owned these knew it was a one-way trip and wanted to ensure what was inside never came out or some of the people left in a hurry and boarded the place up to keep what was inside trapped. Whatever is going on, let's just get inside. Alright, let's go. Okay, something's officially odd here. Okay, this is odd. The place doesn't look as if it's been abandoned for nearly 60 years. Yeah, this is not a good sign. Let's just get this done. Jesus Christ, it looks like a war zone. It looks like a gun fight broke out. But for what reason? Let's keep moving. Maybe there's someone in here who can explain all of this. Maybe in the kitchen. It looks like whoever was shooting wanted it dead or something. Erm, what the scallop? Why is this place such a mess? Why would someone move all this kitchen equipment? Oh!